Okay, here what we're doing, boys and girls. This is the old Z14 choke that used to come in these uh, glass tube amps, and they use them for plate chokes. Well, we can use them in these four uh, CX250B amps too, but they're like 28 bucks, man. So what your alternative is is to uh, on eBay, and you can buy these about two or three dollars a piece, about two dollars a piece. These are a Dale. Two uh, ohm, you know, 20 watt carbon uh, with a ceramic with a hole in them. Now, if you lay these side by side, you know, they're, uh, they're pretty close to the same size. You know, they're pretty close to the same size. Anyway, what you do is you scrape that outside coating. You scrape this outside coating until you see a wire, and then you peel it off like this. See this wire here? Uh, let me show you. You peel all this off, this wire, and you scrape this carbon down until you see a white tube. And then you scrape these ends a little bit right here, and you get this 24-gauge uh, wire here, magnetic wire off of eBay. And you start, you uh, uh, take your one inch piece and scrape all the end off the enamel till it's copper and you solder it to the end and you wrap that dude all the way to the other end. And then you solder it to this end and then you have a choke that will run two 250B amps and it will look like this when you get done doing it. And this is uh, uh, what my mentor has been teaching me to use as a, a cheap alternative to a plate choke and it works on many amps that he's uh, built you know up to a certain amount but anyhow and uh, basically you know like you said you keep uh, pulling this thing off here you know you're eventually just going to get to that white tube underneath there and you scrape it clean you know it's just it's, it's just it's hard to do one handed you know especially me but uh it's uh it's just an easy and cheap way to do a, see, you got a white TV scrape. And that's the way I've been building my chokes here lately, playing with them. Anyhow, I appreciate it, everybody.